Welcome back, everyone. It's Abdallah here, bringing you guys another exciting episode of Lego Movie 2, the video game. Let's continue on, shall we? Alright, so... As you guys can see, we skipped over the initial, like flying through loading screen and now we're gonna get started on this so thanks so much for watching the entire let's play series thanks for entering our giveaway and thanks for smashing that like button let's go so we got some work to do on today's episode right let's let's see what's going on you look like that bad guy uh, is he a buddy of yours oh, i think i saw him somewhere just over these screens oh, 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 let me unlock the controls for you okay well um i'm gonna press a button we're gonna do some stuff. All right, so I do see that there is gonna be some. Um, oh, heck yeah! There's gonna be some uh, masterpieces over here. So let's grab these easy ones. I mean, this entire level is really gonna be short. It looks like because you only need ten of these things. So with that being said, huh? Nothing over that way. Okay, that's perfectly fine. It's probably like way the heck up there. And yeah, you can maybe see it's all the way up there. I don't know. I've got one and that's pretty cool. So let's continue on, shall we? So now that we opened up that area, I'm gonna press this thing again, just to make sure we have this walkway available. Uh, I think that's what I was supposed to do. Uh, maybe not. Okay, anyway, so we're going to bounce on it. So let's do this. We are going to bouncer our way over there. And not fall off. Pretty awesome. Ooh, check that out. That's just a light. Oh, the light looks really cool, though. Anyway, oh, okay. Uh, just making sure. Because <laughs> I don't want to, like, leap before I look. So we're going to make our way over there. Let's see what we got here. Holy moly, I don't know where I am. Um, I shouldn't be alive. I, what? <laughs> I was flying for a second there. All right. Anyway, um, so we've got what? What do we have over here? I'm going to put a little trampoline over here. I'm gonna pop this bad boy open for not what I wanted. Necessarily need that. I need the the masterpiece. What the heck? It's probably like right in plain sight. What the heck? Where is it? What? Oh, it's pr it's in probably inside. Yeah, haha, ha, you got me. Good job, game. <laughs> Come on, Emmett. Get in there, dude. You thought you'd be able to get me, but you didn't. Let me go pick up my thing first. Might as well, right? Hello. What is this? Huh. Oh, a mega relic. Oh, cool. All right, anyway. Uh, since we do have the studs, we might as well go to the shop and purchase one, right? Purchase a masterpiece, easy done, and we can get a, a stud gun. Oh, that's pretty cool. And we can get the Timmy Terrier Benny, Cisterian Benny. Oh, that's interesting. Or we can do this. We can open it. And we got a blue jewel. And the DJ. And the Harmony Cafe. Wow, okay. That's pretty cool. We'll open this one. And we got a pot of gold, hey, and a skeleton. So if we want Emmett to look like a skeleton, and we got an oil gun, oh, pretty cool. If we want Emmett to look like a skeleton, we can do so. So that's pretty great. Like if he if he jumps into hot lava, and we want it to be like realistic, we'd be like, all right, well, he jumped into hot lava. Sorry, buddy. So what we're gonna do right now is we're gonna make this generator that should lower the bridge even further so that we can continue to advance. Mm, or it'll allow me to press this button. Hello? Uh-huh. Yeah, that's a thing. Uh, 
Okay. Okay, don't fall. What? Okay. Interesting. Oh, am I am I gonna bounce up there? Maybe. I don't. I don't that's a little high. I don't think I can make a bouncer over to, there to make that jump. So I have a feeling. <laughs> Just gonna jump off. It's all right. All right. So now that I'm here, I'm right back uh, to where I started. Okay, so there's a couple options. I guess the question is... That's the right height right there, but... Okay, well, let me press it one more time and see what's up. Why is it blue? That makes sense. No. No. Yes. I I don't know. I'm not 100% sure like how or why that happened. It, did I just have to scroll through it? All right, well, whatever. We made it across, doesn't matter. It's Batman! Yo, hell, I'll help you. Hold on, I got you, I got you. Here, check this out. Ooh! <laughs> the grapple gun. Okay. It's right up Batman's alley. All right. And then we got... Oh, we can play as Batman now. Great. It's a matter of finding a way to cause a little chaos and escape. All right. Well, teach me how to use a grapple hook. Okay. So whenever you see something... Reach new, higher locations. Now I can go anywhere? Hold on. I can I can literally go anywhere like I'm Spider-Man. Or, in this case, Batman. Alright, hold on a second. Is that right? Can I just go anywhere and then it'll grapple me up there? No way! That's broken! Well, I guess it's kind of the end of the game, isn't it? What? That was not as cool as I wanted it to be, but I guess it'll make certain things a little easier. The pure upper arm strength of Emmett to like pull on that, that's pretty cool. Okay, well, here we go. Easy. Got it. Simple. Alright, that was pretty easy. Alright, so we got 5 for 10. Looks like I'm gonna have to grapple beam my way through here, right? Grapple gun. A grapple beam. Look at me thinking I'm uh, Samus. Cool. Yeah, I like the grapple beam so far. I think it looks pretty, pretty solid. Okay, we'll take these relics. Pretty fun. Uh, there may or may not be one right there. I'm gonna try this, like, leap of faith. Oh, dude, what? When you're in free fall, you can't use your double jump? Excuse me? No, man, that's not how we do things. <laughs> when you're in free fall, you can't use your double jump. Uh, anyway. Oh, come on. What? Nothing, not grappleable. That is though. 
Oh, was I flying? Hold on, hold on. Was I flying when I did that? Alright, anyway. <laughs> oh, scary. Come on, you can't aim, up aim upwards. Move the camera. Oh, there we go. Hold on, you can move the camera a little bit. It's pretty cool. Alright, I'm down for that. We're good. We're good, man. Come on, Emmett. Okay, so there seems to be another stud over here. Oh, or sorry, masterpiece. We'll take it. Give me that. Thank you. That's that's a throwaway one. If it's just out in the open like that. All right, I'll take it. What's in my hand? Why? Okay, so it looks like I gotta go all the way up there. So let's see what this lady has to say for us. Have you seen Batman? He's meant to be heading into the temple for the wedding ceremony. Have I seen Batman? I hope Batman shows up soon. It's almost starting. I can be Batman. Yeah, yeah, let's go switch to Batman. Alright, here we go. Uh, we're gonna press X. We're gonna be Batman. <laughs> and I'm right here, baby. Oh, I've been told to help you reach the control room. Now the list stuck? That's the last thing we need. Don't suppose you know anything about powering up advanced space lifts? Of course we do. Come here. You'll need to power. You'll need Batman power. can build. Just let, let me not talk to you though. Oh, interesting. Okay, okay. I'm picking up what you're putting down with this one. Pretty easy. Check this out. It's just got to kind of move all the way through. And you press the A button whenever you want the spark to go to the other side. You have to be really quick sometimes. Cool. And now the lift will be ready for us to move onward with. All right. It's pretty cool. This lift will take you right up to the temple control room. Thank you for that. I guess we could play as Batman for a little bit, right? ceremony i'm afraid you're too late it's already begun but if you can power up that fan lift and promise not to hurt me i'll send you to the queen's location okay uh well uh let's take a look what do we got here what do we got here we've got let me hit this thing yeah, that's not what i'm doing oh am i using the grapple hook all right so it looks like each of these to align the crystals to power up the fan lift. Right, but how does one even like Okay, okay, here we go. We're going to align the crystals. Well, that looks like there's just one. And it doesn't look like I can move that one. Doesn't look like I can move that one. This one seems like it needs to get beat up first. So let's break off the danger fists. And that one's facing the wall. So the one that's facing a wall does not need to be facing said wall. Okay. Let me know when you're ready to use it. Cool. Uh, yeah, I'm ready to use it. <laughs> Are you sure you're ready? General Mayhem will try and stop you, you know. In any case, step onto the fan lift to proceed. All right, well, we gotta be Emmett, dude. Like, Emmett, Emmett's like the best. 
Come on, Lego Emmett. All right, Emmett, let's go, dude. Yeah, we're flying. Look at all the masterpieces on the minimap. Whoa, okay. I guess I'm climbing clouds then, huh? harder to get. Okay, not too bad, though. We still have our grapple hook equipped. So we're gonna pull it. We're gonna yank that right back. I guess I'm manually jumping over there. Was it? I thought I had to like battle him or figure a way out. All right, that's fine. Okay. I don't know what happens if we fall, man. I, I don't honestly want to find out either. <laughs> Change in momentum in midair. I love that. Yo, the 515 dolphin. Just like in the movie. All right, here we go. What, do, what am I doing? Painting this thing? Okay. Oof! Wow, got hit by that. Where's my painting thing? Yo, this guy's doing work on me. Really? Hold on, that thing's gonna fall on me. Invincibility frames for the win, yeah! <laughs> look! We have invincibility frames. All these, like, rockets are falling on me, but I have one heart left. Didn't matter. I know what to do here. Check this out. We're gonna go welding tool. It's like if we had heat vision. We're gonna go right inside this thing. Oh, that never happened in the movie. It's pretty cool. Almost on the top. Making our way all the way over here. Check this out. We're here. I suppose I can't stop you. Just promise me you'll think about what you're doing before you disable that force field.
Okay, so we got General Mayhem. Sweet, you can play as that character. You got Jet Wings. Okay, I don't really know what Jet Wings do. You got a tr Oh, we're probably gonna use Tractor Beam and Jet Wings like right now. General Mayhem sure had some advanced tech. Like, for example, using her tractor beam, we could lift super heavy objects with ease. Okay, tractor beam. Here you go. Hold Y. We're gonna put that one in place. We're gonna hold Y. We're gonna put this one in place. So this is where it gets weird. All wrapped up, right? Defeated the villain? Saved the people? Wrong. <laughs> Why don't you like us? We just wanted to play with you. The people were not happy. We soon realized that the queen wasn't evil after all. She just had a thing for Batman. I mean, don't get me wrong. That girl has some serious communication issues. But all she wanted was peace and harmony. And Batman. But she had absolutely no evil agenda. Turns out Rex was the bad guy. I know, right? All that machismo, please. Rex was actually Emmett, but from an alternate universe. Like a version of Emmett that traveled down a different timeline. So, in Rex's version, Emmett crashed into a giant asteroid and ended up stranded on the planet Undar of the Dryar system. That boy turned bitter. He was forgotten, lost, forced to watch others play without him, all that time festering away amongst the dirt. He spent weeks trying to get back on his feet, uh -huh. which, over time, uh -huh. he managed to do. In fact, he built a time machine and filled it with dinosaurs. Emmett changed his name to Rex and traveled back in time. His plan was to save his past self and turn Emmett into the kind of tough guy he wished he could have been. Well, lucky for you, I was around to save the day. I knew what I had to do. Rex's heart was just too bitter, too twisted. He just wouldn't let it go. Unfortunately for Rex, he kind of ceased to exist. Because Emmett stayed true to himself, the whole Rex thing could never have happened. Complicated, but something to do with a space-time continuum. So, yeah, all good. The Queen just wanted us to come hang out and party. And who can blame her? For we are all truly awesome. Kit, <laughs> love you. That was it? Wait, what? <laughs> I don't know about that. So you may be wondering, hey Abdallah, what gives? What's with the muting? Hey, don't worry about it. It looks like the In Grooves Water Tower Music Content ID claims the ending music over here. So I had to take that out. Now typically with all of the games that I play, whenever we go through the credit screen, I do like a unscripted review 
of the entire game and what I thought about it. So, if you guys didn't already, check out my review for the LEGO Movie 2 video game. Watch that video. It's going to be linked in the description. It's in the playlist. There's going to be an iCard. All that fun stuff. Enjoy it. Okay, so now we got to go back to the very ending after the credits. Here we go. Okay, so there's the thing that they kind of revealed about Lucy at the end of the game. All right, well, hey, you know what? Cool. So there was like a little cutscene with that. I, I won't really spoil too much. You guys got to go see the movie. Um, but I'm, I'm actually very curious as to see what else is left. I was sad that there was no final boss. Like, I would have liked to have like jumped all around some sort of boss and attack it. Do some other cool stuff. Maybe if, like, uh, what's her name? Like, whatever. <laughs> whatever I want to be. Maybe if whatever I want to be was, like, taken over by something. And we had to snap her out of it in order to get her going. I don't know. I'm just, like, theorying here of, like, how a final boss could be. Because, like, in the movie, like, whatever I want to be was kind of like a boss. Fake ending? Was that, was that, were those fake credits? I don't know, man. I'm getting out of here, though. That's all I know. Or maybe I'm not. New planet unlocked. Okay, good. Where? Up? The Old West. And we got Planet Sparkles. Okay, so... Like, judging from the looks of this... We have a lot of these open now. Alright, so, here we go. So, I want to say that, that that's probably going to be... That's probably going to be the end, to be honest. Like, there's really nothing else you want to do. But just judging based off of bricks here, I've got 94 out of 475. So that means if I wanted to unlock this mysterious area, I would need a lot more of the masterpieces in order to do so. I would need 400 of them. And then maybe we can see a true ending. I don't know. Um, honestly, if there's 25 in here, 25 in here, like, these are all 25ers. So this is like a hundred, man. A hundred, 125, and that's gonna put me at maybe 225. I'm really gonna have to go back into all of these and start grabbing as many of these things um, as necessary in order to get that 400. So right over here, this is the Galactic Outskirts, which is gonna be something for DLC a little bit later on. But um, yeah, I think that's going to be it. Uh, there's, uh, I could do dedicated episodes based on Old West, based on a Middle Zealand, based on Planet Unikitty, uh, classic Bricksburg, and then Planet Sparkles. I could make them just so you guys see what these planets are all about. And I think that would actually be a little bit more fun. So we'll call this the finale episode because the main story is complete. But of course, I do want to give you guys a little bit of gameplay uh, of these other ones so you guys can get a better idea of what the game is all about. So, ladies and gents, that's going to be it for me today. Thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know, what did you guys think? Was the main story a little bit too short? Are we jumping to conclusions too soon and there's way much more ahead of us? I don't know. And we're going to figure it out together. So, thanks for being here. Enter our giveaway by clicking on the link in the description below and smashing that like button and also letting me know what your favorite part of today's episode was. We'll see you on the next one. Take care.